Good morning. It's the morning after, two day mornings after the open house. And uh, we're going to do a little video of showing what's left. There's not a lot left, but it's very good stuff. And we had qu quite a weekend. And uh, so I'm coming into her schoolhouse studio right now, and we're going to go on a little bit of tour of what's here. And hello, Maria. Oh, hi, John. <laughs> I'm here with a video <laughs> camera. What a surprise. <laughs> what a surprise. Shock, shock. You did look a little surprised. <laughs> so what's going on? What's left in here? Well, there's, there's not too much left. Some of the artists already <clears throat> took their work home, but um, I do have some things, and I'm just sorting through. I got a lot of emails this morning of people who wanted to buy um, some things. And you sold an awful lot of stuff this week. sold an awful lot of stuff. You can see my, my gallery is empty, and hopefully it'll be a studio soon. So uh, what, what, maybe we should start with your prints. Well, I can't think of a better place to start than that. <laughs> I thought you'd like that. <laughs> so we, have, we still have some of John's prints um, available. We have this artist proof. This is $50 of his heron print. Um, and we have a couple of those. We also have um, the yellow barn. And these, these are $75. Um, we have one Gus print still available, which is also $75. And Sheep in the Mist, that's a new one. I don't know if you can see it with the plastic on it. It's, it's a little shiny. Um, I also have a couple of little tiny prints from John. So these are just small prints for thirty dollars each. All right, thank you. And I do still have some pot holders left. So you um, sold all of the India pot holders. I sold out all my India pot holders, but <clears throat> we do have tote bags. So I have a few, five, about five tote bags left. I have one green one and what four pink ones. So and how much are they? These are twenty-five dollars each. They have these pretty silk linings. Um, you can see. I should say we do this every year because a lot of people, of course, most of the people who read our blogs can't come here. So we want to give them a shot at this stuff if they want it. Yes, definitely. And for all you women out there who love your bellies or want to love your bellies, I still have some I Love My Belly, belly Dancing Pot Holders available. And these really need to go because this is an important message to put out into the world. If you've been here Saturday when the belly dancers performed, we had like a thousand people around here all day and it was great. It was really it was, uh, inspiring. It was inspiring. We're going to do more of that belly dancing at Bethlehem. Show Park. your belly. Show your belly. <laughs> so I have one of Karen's dolls left. One of her Find Your Tribe dolls. And you sold all those dolls? I sold all the dolls. We own, we have Believe left, which I think is a sweet one. A pretty sweet I got, one. I got Resist. You got Resist. Persist. Was a persist. 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 Yeah. Someone else got Resist. And I sold all of Susie's shawls, but I still have two pairs of her. Now, these are hand-spun, hand-knit, um, fingerless gloves. A lot of the wool comes from Susie's own, own, sh own sh um, goats and bunnies. And it's wool, mohair, and angora. They're very soft, and they're very warm. And very beautiful, <laughs> all at the same time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How much are they? These are $38. Oh, and the dollars are, the doll is $30. Karen's doll is $30. And then we have a few, um, we have a few pins from Chris. Um, you can just kind of go down. I mean, this one's like a little New Mexico landscape. Mm -hmm. This one looks like a fern. Maybe we should take it to New Mexico. I know. Here's an abstract with these lovely beads that move in a circle. And these are, we can see, between 44 and 36 and $44. And you can ask me about them if you have any questions. And I also have some more of um, Chris's necklaces left. Just a few. And you can, you can see them here. Once again, they're, they range in price from about $44. You see this one with the, with the lovely jangle beads. I love that. <laughs> That's nice. And I have one scarf left. I have one of my Og winter scarves left. So this has a nice, soft, and warm backing. Um, and, and tell me about Og. Kenna Og is a quilter who sends me this beautiful fabric all the time, and I'm so grateful to her. Um, they're known as the Og Scarves. They're known as the Og Scarves, that's right. I'm actually sending her one of the birdhouses as a gift. And we do have some of these birdhouses still available from Linda. These are unusual. These are hand-woven. They're her own design. She designed them after gourd birdhouses, and these are $50 each. 
And my scarf is $60. I forgot to mention that. I have a few more pussy hats. They're smaller sizes. I only have four of those left. So I just remind them what the pussy hats are. The pussy hats are, were started during the women's walk in January, and <clears throat> they're a sign of, of solidarity and between women and, and women's rights. So, yeah, how much do they cost? These are ten dollars each. Um, five dollars, half of the money will go to the Army of Good. The other half goes to Barbara, who made them. And then um, I believe these are these are Kitty's prints, but I think I'm almost positive they're sold. I have someone who's been asking about them, so I'm pretty sure they're sold. In case they're not, how much are they? In case they? they're not, they're forty dollars. They're signed um, prints by Kitty Farnham, and they're beautiful drawings. You can see them. Yeah, they are very special. And the last thing I have is some of Sue's, a couple of Sue Smith's hats. These are um, this one is fifteen dollars. It's a big one, and this one with the great tassels is twenty dollars. Uh, I said Icelandic wool on this one. And I think that's about it. I have someone asking about her red sweater. It is a small size, probably my size. So. This gives you an idea, people out there. How much is that? Sweater. Her sweater is $55. Well, this is great. So, so if people are interested in this, what do they do? You can email me at maria at fullmoonfiberart.com. Congratulations on a very successful it's art show. It's been very right? successful. It's been yeah, very successful. I think we have a record-breaking weekend for us all around. Yeah. Very nice. It's been terrific. Thank you for all of your support. And, and uh, this, this stuff is going to be here for a few days. If you want it, if if it lasts that long, if it lasts, yeah, I, mean, I, <laughs> I sold a lot of week. stuff yesterday. I was, I when I woke up this morning. I said I better check, so I had to pull everything else that I sold overnight. So That's it's it. going quick. Maria at fullmoonfiberart.com. Thank you, Maria. Thanks, John.